Hey guys, welcome back to another Chop Chop video and this week I'll be showing you guys how to make some Jamaican Easter bun. We're gonna start off by combining the wet ingredients. Right now we're adding some sugar. Yeah, that's definitely not wet, but yeah, add half cup of brown sugar. Quarter cup of honey. I'm gonna get some brown in. Add one teaspoon of it. And we're gonna add some molasses and half tablespoon of that. one teaspoon of vanilla extract then we're gonna add um, four tablespoon of melted butter ensure that it's at room temperature then just use a whisk and basically mix the ingredients until it's um, until it's smooth Then we're gonna get some Guinness. Add one cup of the Guinness to the mixture. So we're just gonna mix it up again a little bit. And then when it's um, nice and smooth, we're just gonna add one egg to the mixture. So just basically whisk it until everything is combined. And we're gonna get the dry fruits. So right here we got some raisins, some cherries, and some mixed peel. All of that is one cup. Add that to the wet ingredients and then we're gonna go ahead and give it a mix. Okay, so we're gonna move on to the dry ingredients. Add two cups of all-purpose flour to a bowl. Add two teaspoons of baking powder. Then we're gonna add the spices and the salt. A detailed list of the ingredients is in the description below. Use a rubber spatula to mix the ingredients. Alright, so here we have um, the wet and dry ingredients. Now we're gonna combine them together. So you're just gonna add the flour mixture gradually to the, um, the wet ingredients and then just mix it. Ensure that all the lumps are basically gone. Then you're gonna repeat the process until everything is thoroughly mixed together. Yes, and as I said, I'll make sure that you get all of those lumps out. and just repeat the process until all of the flour is gone.
all right so yep so basically when all of the ingredients are combined you, you shouldn't be seeing any flour or anything like that the batter is ready um, to go in the oven so we have a 9 by 5 baking pan here we're just gonna grease it we're gonna use some butter and then just wipe it all around ensure that it's greased properly We're just going to add the batter to the uh, baking pan. Yep, so what I'm doing here is just, just using a toothpick to go through the batter to even, kind of even it out. You could try this as well. Alright, so we're ready for the oven. So when the oven is at 350 degrees Fahrenheit, we're going to put it in and bake it for about 60 minutes to 70 minutes. Then we're gonna make the honey glaze. So you're gonna put the burner on high, add about half cup of water to the pot, then basically add two tablespoons of honey. So we're just going to keep this on high until it's reduced. When it reaches to about that consistency, just remove it from the burner. So yep, so after 60 minutes, just checking on the bun. I use a toothpick to see if it's all done and it came on clean. So at this point, we're just gonna remove it from the oven. Yep, so here it is without glaze. We're gonna apply the glaze now to basically give it some color. Ensure that you get the honey glaze all over the top of the bun. Allow it to cool for about 30 minutes before you cut it. There I have it guys. Some beautiful Jamaican Easter bun. Don't forget to smash that like button. Leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe. Also check out our food blog. ChopChopJA.com
Thanks for watching. I'm out.